Here's a time step I made up the other day. Uh, I was sitting in Starbucks, and I guess I had too much caffeine, because I think it's kind of tricky. Here it is. Um, start with a stomp, brush hop, and then we go into hop shuffles. We do three of those. And a one and a two and a three. So hop on counts one, two, and three. That should help you. A one and a two and a three, and start the new one. A four with a ball stomp, kind of like our regular stomp time steps. A four. Reverse it. A five and a six and a seven. A eight. Then we go into a long section here of hop shuffles. A eight. A one and two, three, four, five, six, seven. A eight. Okay. So we do like a seven hop shuffles. Um, so we do two kind of short ones, and then we do one set of long ones. Again, this is hop shuffle, and it's a triplet rhythm. One and a two and a three and a four. This is tricky. I consider this a, um, an intermediate time step, because if you can get that rhythm right, that means you're, you're, um, you know how to do those rolling triplets. Let's take a look and get this thing going. Starts on count eight. Five, six, seven. So that's, that's the time step I came up with. Um, we're going to try it without music, so we can kind of start slow and then we'll build up fast. So that was once on the right and once on the left. I think that's a good place to start. Let's try it again, that same tempo. Five, six, seven. So it's, it has um, portions of a time step in it, that definitely, um, and the rest is hop shuffles. So um, stay off your heels except for when we do the stomp, and keep your rhythm a swing rhythm. Let's go a little faster. Five, six, five, six, seven. Since we're going a little faster, let's try four sides now. Right, left, right, left. Five, six, five, six, seven. I think that's all I have in me. So if you want to do it again, feel free to rewind it. Um, let's call that a let's call that a hop uh, a hop shuffle time step.